Okay, we're gonna program the PIC 16F887 using uh, Microchip MPLAB IDE using the CSSC compiler hooked up to the Picket 2 programmer. We're gonna do go to a project, go to Project Wizard, click Next. Like I said, we're gonna use this chip right here, the PIC 16F887. Click Next. Uh, make sure you're using the right compiler. Uh, the one I'm using today is this CCSC compiler. It's easy to write. Uh, click Next. Uh, we got to give this uh, project a name. I'm just going to name it T1. Save. Next. You don't, want, you don't need to add anything here. Click Next. Make sure everything is right. Finish. Okay, we're ready to go. Go to over here, go to new file, click on it. And over here, my notepad, I already had my code. I'm gonna copy it and paste it on my new file. Notice that all the letters just black and white. Uh, we're gonna save this, save file, and we're gonna name it t1.c. See, notice as soon as we gave it the .c extension, uh, you got some colors showing up, meaning that it's working. So what we're gonna do is uh, right here in our project, we're gonna add this file we just created. So we go to source file, right click, click add file, and here is T1. Open it up. Notice it came out here. Now what we gotta do is just build the project. So to build and go to this icon, see these two icons right here? Well, we're just gonna build it off. Click build off. Compile successfully. Zero errors, one warning. Uh, and if you notice over here in your project, all the files been created. So what we're going to do, we're going to program it to our chip. Uh, today, like I said, we're going to use the Pick it, Pick Kick 2 programming program. Click on that. It, re it talks to the Pick 2 programmer, Pick it 2 programmer, and uh, it found the right chip and it found the right programmer. So that's done. So now what we're going to do is you see these uh, little icons over here, where we're going to click the first one, program the target device. Click on that. Found it, and it's programmed to our chip successfully. That's it. Thank you. Okay, now we're going to program uh, the, same pro the same program that we just did using the PIC uh, microcontroller. Now we're going to use the Arduino chip, and we're going to time that. And, and compare how long it takes to suppose uh, using the MPLAB IDE. It took about two minutes to program with the MPLAB IDE. Let's see how it takes with Arduino. Oh, this is going to be really fast, guys. What you're going to do is just going to go here. You go to new. Uh, I have already, like I said, I already have my program here. This is uh, written for the Arduino, same program. I'm going to copy it. And I'm going to paste it over here, my workspace in the Arduino. There it is, and then you go to you go to here to upload. It's talking to the Arduino chip, compiling the sketch. My Arduino Uno is, is connected to my USB COM3. Uh, it's compiling, I'm programming, and there it is. Successfully done. Successfully binary sketch size. Here's the byte size, and we're done. That took less than a minute. Easy. Thank you.